Do you struggle to keep your refrigerator cleaned? I am gonna help you with that because in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to clean a refrigerator in less than 10 minutes. So the first step is gathering your supplies. All you'll need is all-purpose cleaner and a microfiber cloth. So you wanna fold your microfiber cloth into two. So if it's out like this, you're gonna go one, two. The reason why you wanna do that is because you're gonna use all sides of the rag. This is just to prevent you using multiple rags. So then the first part is just to take everything off of your fridge. This is really hard to clean around. So the next step is cleaning the top. And then cleaning the front. You can clean the handles, but you're gonna be opening the fridge several times and then so the handles would be last. This is a vacation rental where we live and on the weekends we rent out our home and so we have to pack up everything and go. The less things I have in the fridge, the less I can put in the cooler so we can get to our next destination. So I actually don't keep a lot in here, which makes it super easy to clean. So this is the fridge at my mom's house and we have a lot more going on in here. I figured I'd film this and make it a little more interesting seeing a different kind of fridge. As you can see, this is a French door fridge that opens up that way. Mine does not. And we've got all kinds of different compartments here, different sizes of compartments. And these things need to be cleaned and everything can be taken out. This is, um, my mom just moved here, so uh, we haven't done the deep cleaning yet. So you can probably see up close that there's quite a bit of dirt that we can get here. So I can clean this in the sink with just a sponge and some soap, some dish soap. And I can use different brushes here on the edges to get it cleaned really well. And then I can just rinse it off and dry it and put it back. So I just wanted to show you a different fridge in case you were thinking, oh, that fridge, it's so boring because it's so clean. I get it because I like those satisfying videos where you could just watch dirty things become really clean again. It's really satisfying. Put some all-purpose cleaner on the rag direct. Take things out, wipe, and put it back. And then this one, take it out, and then like this. And then on the sides, just check for any marks and lift things clean and put it back. But like I said, this is just a really quick clean, just to make it look a little bit better. So the first step in keeping a clean fridge is to pull out everything and look at everything, see if things are expired, checking the date. So this is organic ketchup and it's best if fused by October 28th, 2024. The next step is starting from the top shelf and the top shelf, it can be removed and then you can clean it in the sink if it's really bad. If you want to do a maintenance cleaning, um, simply just take a microfiber cloth with some all-purpose cleaner. I make my all-purpose cleaner with a drop of dish soap hydrogen peroxide about half a cup and then the rest I fill it up with water. You can use any kind of all-purpose cleaner you like. So the first thing you want to do is start from the top of the fridge because if there's any dirt or, or crumbs or anything it's going to fall down. This is me attempting to film while cleaning at the same time and making sure I'm in the shot. So I apologize in advance for this filming, but I just wanna show you that. You start from cleaning at the top and then clean the sides of the refrigerator and then you start working your way down so that anything you're cleaning from up above 
that may have fallen like crumbs or anything like that goes down to the bottom where you're going to be cleaning anyway. The drawers are a little more tricky because they have more grooves and things like that. You can also pull it out and wash it, which I recommend doing for the first time cleaning the fridge. Um, just get all of the gunk and things. You might need a toothbrush to get into the corners. I just use the point of the rag to get it. And it usually sticks pretty well to the microfiber cloth if it's a little bit damp. And then also when you take this out, so there was a lot of dirt there. Okay, this is buff dried. And then I'm just gonna do the same for the bottom sh shelf. That's probably the hardest part is like figuring out where the things go back. All the way on the top of the fridge, you know, just really just get it good clean in. And you can lift the butter area, wipe it down. And then just take everything out. You can also take out these trays. And you just lift up, just kind of wiggle and lift up. Just don't want to break it. You can wipe it out or you can, if it's your first time cleaning your fridge, you can wash it in the sink. You can throw it in the dishwasher in the upper part of the dishwasher, but um, just make sure you get it buff dry because it's gonna look really nice and clear. These little handles, they get dirty and crummy. And then this side gets crummy too. So you, know, you could put it anywhere you want. I just like making sure that the bottles fit. This looks, when you see it dirty behind there, you can just take it off and clean it up. Okay, this is my clean fridge. After just 10 minutes of cleaning, the handles, you just wanna clean those really well. But anyway, I hope you liked this video, and if you did, give it a thumbs up. You can also subscribe to my channel and tap the notification bell too to be notified of the very next video. Thanks for watching, we'll see you next time. Bye.